Sergio, uh, we had an interesting way of meeting. I've never met this man before, so <laughs> you're just I don't know what you're talking about. about. I've been chained, chained up, Sergio. This is, Craig <laughs> comes in. And he's like, "Who's this bald guy chained to my couch?" Who yeah. is he? In all fairness, Craig runs every. Craig runs the company to the ground, <laughs> and then I step in with I Corey. Know. You'd be this much of a comic. <laughs> <laughs> my, our first meeting was not like this. No, we, well, we it was on, quite different we'll, on the we'll, podcast. We're we'll on the just, podcast the first we'll time around. We'll describe how yeah. we met. So, so I heard background. I heard him on the podcast talking about being a huge Trump supporter. Not kidding. <laughs> oh my god! How he, dare you? How dare you? <laughs> He's going to send me a Corey, message. Do you know what's happened to him? He just turned into literally an obnoxious comic that cannot say a word without a punchline. Uh, <laughs> it's the wait, camera's on. No, it's not. Yes, he's he's told me there was no punchline. Now it's every punchline. Every, uh, I was in coaching, I go, yeah, you need some more punchlines. Now he's doing them in real life. It's being, your fault. Then. And I'm being punched. Then it's your fault. Yeah. You told them more punchlines. <laughs> yes. That's, so I heard I him on a punch pod. me with every single punch. <laughs> okay, he wasn't specific. Right. Like like most men, he wasn't clear. <laughs> um, he I heard him on a podcast. I heard him on a podcast. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep a count. Yes, I heard, <laughs> we'll see. Oh, it's like Mike Tyson like over here. One, two. I heard him on a podcast, and he had some uh, compelling stories to tell. I thought, oh, this is really cool. So I sent him a video clip of me doing comedy, and I said, oh, next time I'm, at, I'm in LA, I'll hit you up. And I did, and then he decided... By the way, without a dick pic. Well, I sent him a video. Oh, hit, hit um, you up. <laughs> okay. So then, <laughs> I, just, I, I, I legit sent you a video. It just wasn't a dick yes, pic video. Um, so then, when I got in here, he said, Hey, why don't we just do this on the podcast? <laughs> so our meeting, our first yeah, meeting. Yeah, unprepared, we got on the podcast, and then we talked about life and some similarities. And then his, the person supporting him moved away. And he said, oh, since you're moving up here, why don't you consider... Well, she didn't move. She was with me for four years. Yeah. Her dad recruited yeah, her. Yeah, but she, meaning she was no longer going to be available That's to be right. here. Yeah. So then we met a few times, uh, hired someone else, and who did not work out. And oh, then, by the way, the one who was leaving was against you. Yes, because she, she said, said, I'm a comic. <laughs> because he goes, you're a comic. And she says, he's going to tell a bunch of lies the whole time. <laughs> and here we are. <laughs> And here we are. So he's going to be all about him. <laughs> so I resisted hiring him, and I hired someone else who did not work out. That's with a capital N. Yeah. That was really a tough time. And then, and I said, you know, the hell with it. I'm going to ignore Ricky, my former assistant. And I said, I'm going to hire Sergio. And then she goes, Oh, go ahead. She says, I'm not against it. I just thought da 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 da. da. And she and I are still really close. She came to our show recently. She, yes, she was. But uh, yeah, Ricky's awesome. But you have been. Really, and I have no punchline to this. You have been really amazing for me. Is is to balance out this craziness of which I am, and I admit it. And I know I'm crazy. First step in facing a problem is admitting you have one. <laughs> so good. <laughs> and so, so far, you've never admitted anything. So, hey, oh, so, I. So you better start living that that proclamation. <laughs> I've never had you admit anything except, <laughs> except for I have a belly and you don't. Uh, so. Anyway, yeah, so you came on here and you really got things regimented and in control. And uh, so now we can really start firing. We have all these projects and Corey and I have been working on. We just did a podcast together, which yes. we produced. Mm -hmm. And um, no, no mm -hmm doesn't work. It was great. That's, that's, <laughs> you should know that the producer. Yes. <laughs> it's not work. I need a visual yes, not with your head. No, like when no. you sit in the emergency aisle yeah. or the exit aisle at the airport, I need a visual and a sound. Oh, yes. yeah, they get mad at you. Yes. If, oh, yeah, they say, I'm going to need a visual and a sound of if you hear and acknowledge what I'm saying. But I want more than that. That was a lead into what was the podcast we just produced.